Welcome to the annual awards ceremony for students in grades 9 through 11. I'm Julia Chaff, the principal at Guilford High School, and I'm delighted to be here to recognize the hard work and dedication of our students this year. My only regret, of course, is that we're not in person. Soon, I'm hoping we will all be in person again. In the meantime, I want to thank our department chairs, faculty, and assistant principals for working so hard to make this celebration happen today. In addition, I want to thank all of our parents and families who love, support, encourage, and guide your students every step of the way. Our students being recognized today have demonstrated academic excellence and achievement in their classes this year. So without further ado, let's recognize and celebrate them. On behalf of the art department, I would like to congratulate the following underclassmen. In drawing one, Alexa Handelman and Alexandra Petonito. For drawing two, Madeline Merkel Ward, Alexandra Petonito, and Alexa Handelman. For drawing three, Julia Schroes. For painting two, Kathleen Marinus. For sculpture one, Emily Hopkins. And for special arts, Bo Kellogg. Congratulations, artists. The Technology Department is pleased to present a special award for excellence in technological leadership. This year's recipient has gone above and beyond the curriculum. I would like to take this opportunity to recognize Michael Neese and his work on developing a more consistent renewable energy source. He was a recipient of multiple awards at this year's 2021 Connecticut Science and Engineering Fair. He has received the award in Renewable Energy the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration Award, and the Fox Pest Control Award for Environmental Management. Congratulations on all your achievements, Michael. I'd like to take this opportunity to present this year's Excellence in Architectural Drafting Award. Each year, this award is given to a student that has shown exceptional work and interest in the architectural field. The student has taken on the challenge to design and build a green energy house for next year's 73rd Connecticut Home Show Competition. She has already started working on this ambitious project. This year's Excellence in Architectural Drafting Award goes to Olivia Bugatti. Hello, my name is George Cooksey, and I am proud to represent the English Department at Guilford High School as we honor those students who have distinguished themselves in their English courses this year. Our first awards go to those who distinguished themselves in World Humanities English. The award goes to Anushri Ajgankar, Gordon Chen, Elliot Evans, Adeline Filardi, Stephen Hall, Lorelei Heidkamp, Sage Jackson, Gabriel Kellner, Jason Lee, Samuel Mayo, Claire Michelet, Molly Peterson, Cole Philbin, Aubrey Schwanfelder Nelkin, Evan Stein, George Wiley, and Ella Young. Congratulations. Our second award goes to those who have distinguished themselves in sophomore English. The awards go to Nora Beres, Ali Martineau, Sean Melvin, 
Farid Samu, Ariana Tomasi, Riley Weed, Eliana Weinzimmer, and Tor Wetlaufer. Our awards for excellence in honors English go to Hannah Contessa, Ruby DeGorsi, Maddie Merkel Ward, Riley Mullet, Cassandra Pringle, and Leela Rooser. The awards for general excellence in junior English go to Charlotte Atherton, Ryan Ammer, Alyssa Chen, Matthew Fox, Zachary Gray, Kyra Hawks, Lorelai King, and Yanli Muse. The award for overall excellence in AP Language and Composition goes to Annika Accomando, Madison Daggett, Matthew Gottsbauer, Jerry Lee, and Luke Robbins. And the award for IB Literature A goes to Aaliyah Gibbons and Hannah Grief. Congratulations to all of our award winners tonight. Well done. Hello, my name is Barbara Tokarska and I'm proud to represent the math department as we recognize this year's award recipients for their outstanding effort and achievement in mathematics. For Algebra 1, we would like to recognize Alexa Handelman, Ryan Bretman, Andres Gutierrez, Olivia Pianchi, Jasmine Laria, Adriana Piaschik, and Coleman Love. For geometry, we recognize Molly Peterson, Jasmine Ganum, George Wiley, Alexa Suchi, Cole Philbin, Madeline Lee, Grace Barlage, Olivia Kazin, Alex Milano, Sage Kellogg, and Cooper Schwartz. For Algebra 2, we recognize Cole Philbin, Kendra Johnson, Molly Peterson, George Wiley, Ariana Tomasi, Clara Gom, Corinne Puchalski, Nolan Stankowicz, Juliana Montgomery, Jason Lee, Ruby DeGorzi, Zachary Nice, Ella Young, and Mark Michna. For pre-calculus, congratulations to Justin Hess, Cassandra Pringle, 
Riley Weed, and Riley Mullet. In IB Mathematics 11, Hannah Greif. For AP Calculus AB, Jerry Lee, Matthew Kotzbauer, and Reka Ishby. For AP Computer Science, Alex Santagato. And two special awards for the evening. One is the Charlotte Elton Cross Service Award. Charlotte Elton Cross was a beloved Guilford citizen who spent countless hours volunteering as a tutor at the high school for students struggling in math. In her honor, we annually recognize students who volunteer and give service to the math department in various ways. On behalf of the math department, this year, we'd like to recognize and thank Riley Mullet. And for the final award of the evening, the Mike Mulvihill Outstanding Effort Award. Mike Mulvihill was a Guilford High School math teacher who was dedicated to helping all students learn and achieve in mathematics. The Mike Mulvihill Award goes to a student who has shown outstanding effort to learn and improve in mathematics. This year, the award goes to Farid Samu. Congratulations to all our award recipients. Hi, my name is Tom Boats, and I am the department chair of the Guilford High School Music Department. It is my pleasure and privilege to present the awards for the underclassmen of Guilford High School for both achievement and service within our music department. First, for outstanding achievement in music in this 2020-21 school year, Joshua Chen, Liam Melvin, Luke Wainer, Sean Fannin, Madeline Anthony, Jackson Philbin, Carter Bryan, Clara Gaum, Ruby DeGorson, Matthew Kotzbauer, Sophia Mead, Natalie Bryan, Reka Ishibi, Christopher Har, Joy Chang, Luke Robbins, Valentine Purdue Repo, Dominic Daydak, Jerry Lee, and Layla Rooser. Next, we have the awards for outstanding service in music. These are for students who went above and beyond for the three music teachers in assisting in the various duties to enable the smooth operation of our performing ensembles. Here are those awards. Abby Moore. Taylor Barbario, Tyler Skopinski, Cassandra Pringle, Taylor Smith, Eliza Chamberlain, Kendall Mulligan, Melick Top, Ava Riga, Ruby DeGorsi, Nathan Dean, Gianna Manio, Alyssa Chen, Aaliyah Gibbons, Ashlyn Garrick, Catherine Hicks, Hannah Dang, Reka Ishibi, Claire 
Kingsbury, and Yanli Mu. We thank you all for your tremendous help during this past year, and congratulations all the underclass recipients of the Music Department Award. Hello and good evening. My name is Mrs. Harrington and tonight it is my pleasure to nominate the following freshmen for the Physical Education Award. Each student here is recognized for their exemplary participation, behavior and effort for both virtual and in-school class attendance. Period one, Cooper Schwartz and George Wiley. Period three, Henry Young. Period six, Jason Lee and Ella Young. And period seven, Coleman Love. Congratulations to everyone. You guys did a great job. You've been doing a great job all semester and very deserved of this award. Take care. Hi, Clara, this is Mr. Vidrani. I just wanna let you know you've been chosen as a recipient of the PE award this year. I um, just wanted to let you know that I appreciate your positive attitude that you bring to class every day, the way that you're kind to others, um, and just the way that you participate on a, on a daily basis, and um, you're very deserving of the award, and thanks for a great year, and we'll see you soon. Bye. Hi, Tyler. This is Mr. Vidrani. I just want to let you know that I chose you for one of the PE awards this year uh, for bringing your positive attitude and your energy to class, your athleticism, um, just the way that you're kind to others. And I just want to thank you for having a great year and um, congratulations and we'll see you soon. Hi Aiden, this is Mr. Bedrani. Just want to let you know you've been chosen to receive the PE award this year uh, for sophomores for your daily participation, um, your effort that you bring to class, the way that you're kind to other people, um, your positive attitude, and just everything that you brought to class. It was awesome spending a semester with you, and I wish you the best of luck moving forward. Very deserving of the award, uh, and congratulations. Hi, Ava, this is Mr. Vedrani. Just wanna let you know you've been chosen as a recipient of the PE uh, award for the sophomores this year. Uh, thanks for coming to class with a positive attitude every day um, and participating with effort and showing your athleticism. Uh, thanks for being kind to all the other students in class and you're just enjoyable to be around. You're very deserving of the award and congratulations. Bye, Eva. Want to give a PE award to Christian Peterson. Uh, Christian, I have in class right now, is doing a great job. Um, I appreciate his attitude, um, his effort, always is in class, working hard, doing what he's supposed to do. And I uh, really enjoy having him a student and he's done a great job so far this quarter and this semester and I uh, wanna give him the PE award. So to Christian Peterson, congratulations, Christian. Wanna give the PE award to Justin Hess. Uh, Justin, I appreciated having you in class first semester. I uh, want to thank you for your effort, uh, the energy you brought to class, your enthusiasm, even if you did lose to me in horse and badminton and ping pong. But anyway, uh, congratulations. Thank you for uh, being a great student and uh, PE award. Want to give a PE award to Jasmine Gnome. Uh, Jasmine, I loved having you in class first semester. Um, I appreciated your positivity you brought to the class every single day. Um, you were a great student to have and you got along so well with your classmates. Um, you were involved in all of our activities and I really enjoyed having you. And I wanna congratulate you and uh, thank you for being a great student. PE Award. This award is given to outstanding high school students who have excelled in physical education this school year. I have decided to give this award to two phenomenal students who have consistently demonstrated enthusiasm, cooperation, leadership, and enjoyment of physical activity. These two students were excellent role models for their classmates. After conversing and observing these students within each class, it was clear that they both demonstrated an understanding that physical activity provides opportunities for enjoyment, challenge, self-expression, and social interaction. 
it is my pleasure to give this award to freshman Anushri Edgonkar and sophomore Cassie Pringle. Congratulations, ladies. This is well deserved. This award is presented to an outstanding high school student who has excelled in sophomore physical education class during the 2021 school year. This student consistently demonstrated enthusiasm for physical activity, cooperation amongst their peers, leadership, and of course, overall enjoyment of physical activity. This student also demonstrated a willingness to assist others during their physical education class. Day in and day out, this student was an excellent role model for their classmates. In many conversations with this student, she demonstrated a clear understanding that physical activity provides opportunities for enjoyment, challenge, self-expression, and social interaction. It is my pleasure to give this award to Rylan Jacobson. Hello, my name is Scott McDowell and I'm the science chair at Guilford High School. I'd like to welcome you to this year's underclass award ceremonies. Our first science award is the Bausch and Lomb Honorary Science Award. Every year since 1933, Bausch and Lomb honors outstanding high school science students with the Bausch and Lomb Honorary Science Award. Recipients of this award are among the highest achievers academically at their school. There are also individuals that contribute positively within their school community. Winners of the award are automatically considered for a Bausch and Lomb Science Scholarship at the University of Rochester. This year's awardee is Rika Shibi. The George Eastman Young Leaders Award. The George Eastman Young Leaders Award, offered by the University of Rochester, is given to students that show strong leadership experience at school and in the community, obtain high grades in challenging courses, and demonstrate extensive involvement in extracurricular activities. This year's awardee is David Creer. The Frederick Douglass and Susan B. Anthony Award. The Frederick Douglass and Susan B. Anthony Award is given to a student that has demonstrated a commitment to understanding and addressing difficult social issues. This includes participating in community action programs that benefit those in need. This candidate must also be a scholar in school while taking rigorous subjects that will help them build on the qualities this award honors. This year's awardee is Mary Abigail Moore. The MIT Network of Educators in Science and Technology Award. The MIT Network of Educators in Science and Technology Award is awarded to the students that have excelled in physics and who are planning to enter a career in science and engineering. This year's awardee is Matthew Kotzbauer. The Rensselaer Medal Award. The Rensselaer Medal Award is awarded to a student that excels in science, math, and demonstrates the potential for success in challenging academic setting. The student also exhibits a significant involvement in extracurricular activities. This year's awardee is Owen Campaign. The Xerox Award for Innovation. The Xerox Award for Innovation is given to a student that has a strong interest in innovation and information technology. This student also must have a desire to gain exposure to new technologies outside of the classroom. This year's awardee is Cassandra Pringle. The Science Involvement Award. The Guilford High School Science Involvement Award was created to recognize those students who lead and create extracurricular opportunities that helped drive their desire to learn science as well as to give others a chance to do the same. Students who receive this award are not afraid of taking risks and attempting things that have not been done. These students are for the current leaders of extracurricular science activities at Guilford High School. They are also the individuals we will see leading the science community in the future. The winner for this year's award is Colin Matiad. The 
The next award is the Junior AP Biology Award. This award will be given to the following students. Hannah Dang, Jerry Lee, Jay Patel, Olivia Tercia. The sophomore AP Biology Awards will be given to Joshua Chen, Justin Hess, Riley Mullet, and Ava Pascarella. Our Junior AP Chemistry Awards this year will be given to Madison Daggett and Moses Muamba. Our Sophomore AP Chemistry Award will be given to Joy Tsiang. Our Junior AP Physics One Awards will be awarded to Owen Campaign and David Crair. Our Sophomore AP Physics One Awards will be given to Vanessa Toyn and Patrick Zhang. Our Junior AP Physics Two Award is being given to Jerry Lee. Our IB Biology Award is being given to Katrina Muse. Our IB Chemistry Award is going to be given to Calvin Brooks. For IB Physics Award, Hannah Graith. Our award for Early College Experience Environmental Science will be given to Olivia Skapjinski and Matthew Whaley. Our Junior Anatomy and Physiology Award this year goes to Rebecca Patrizio. Our Junior Biology Awards this year are going to Allison Bickford, Morgan Corpuel, Jessica DiRusso, Vanessa Munoz, and Thomas Ziamba. Our Sophomore Biology Awards are going to Ruby DeGorsi, Jasmine Ganum, Annalise Kish, Colin Krupp, Fareed Samo, and Mia Scarpolino. Our Freshman Biology Award is being given to the following students. Taylor Barbero, Gabrielle Kellner, Alexander Milano, Cole Philbin, Sophia Schonbag, and Gigia Tian. Our Junior Chemistry Awards this year are going to Colby Ambrosiak, Caroline Kane, Brennan Sinaway, and Sydney Witherell. Our Sophomore Chemistry Awards are being given to Braden Benben, Hannah Contessa, and Elise Halsema as well as Olivia Kaysen, Gianna Minio, and Zoe Rumanoff. Our Freshman Chemistry Awards this year are going to Gordon Chen,
Clara Gam, Stephen Hall, Jason Lee, and Julia Montgomery. Our Geophysical Science Awards this year will be given to Daniel Barge, Quinlan Bradley, Stephen Hall, Alexa Handelman, Hanalor Kampouras, Coleman Love, and Cooper Schwartz. Our Junior Physics Award this year will be awarded to Sean Fannin, Matthew Fox, and Christopher Murphy. And the last award for this award ceremony is going to be given to Moira McGovern as a Science Student Service Award. I would like to thank everybody for attending these award ceremonies and I would also like to once again congratulate everybody who has worked so hard to achieve these awards. Greetings everyone. My name is Mr. Ralph Russo. I'm the Social Studies Department Chair at Guilford High School. I'm very pleased to be sharing this year's award winners with you. In grade nine in our Modern World History course, following students have demonstrated excellence as reported by their teachers. Taylor Barbiero, Quinlan Bradley, Luke Braverman, Ryan Bretman, Carter Bryan, Gordon Chen, McKinley Cho, Braden DePetris, Elliot Evans, Anna Fagan, Adeline Filardi, Clara Gom, Jasmine Ganim, Seth Gillinston, Jason Lee, Leia Lorello, Claire Michelet, Cole Philbin, Brenna Chichi, Ella Young, Henry Young. Congratulations to our ninth grade Modern World History Award winners. In grade 10, the following students have exemplified excellence in their Modern World History II course. Max Banning, Grace Barlidge, Ruby DeGiorzi, Jessica Giroli, Justin Hess, Olivia Kazin, Gianna Menio, Michael O'Brien, Cassandra Pringle, Corrine Pachowski, Jan Rivera Crows, Farid Samu. In grade 10 civics, the following students have demonstrated excellence. Alexander Anestis, Ella Beasley, Courtney Bavona, Ella Clark, Hannah Contessa, Kim Evans, Alexandra Glaskoff, Clara Laughlin, Emily Lynn, Coco McCartan, Sydney McCartan, Madeline Merkel Ward, Riley Mullet, Michael Neese, Eva Riga, Lila Rooser, Julia Shores, Kylie Simon, Ariana Tomasi, Delaney Victor. Congratulations to our grade 10 award winners. In grade 11, the following students have demonstrated excellence in United States history. Allison Bickford, Summer Charbonneau, Madison Daggett, Brooke Feldman, Matthew Fox, Olivia Gill, Shannon Hunt, Arian Karki, Joseph Pasieka, Max Petra, Alexander Santagata, Lillian Vinzel, Jorge Zuniga. Congratulations. In the International Baccalaureate Program, History Grade 11, the award-winning recipient is Hannah Grief. In AP United States History, the award is named for a colleague, Joseph Peluso, who was a longtime AP Social Studies teacher at Guilford High School. Joe is a big believer in skills 
And the following students demonstrated excellence in social studies skills regarding AP United States history. Dominic Dadek, Connor Deboda, and Nicholas Meeks. Congratulations. In grade 11, in the Theory of Knowledge course in IB, the award recipient is Hannah Grief. Congratulations to all of our underclass award winners in social studies. Congratulations and thank you. Hi, good evening. My name is Kara Mulqueen Teasdale and I am proud to be the theater arts coordinator here at Guilford High School. While this year has not been an ideal year in the performing arts because of some limitations and challenges that we've had, I am so grateful to have students who are up to those challenges and still allowed us to produce some really neat pieces of theater both in the classroom and uh, outside in our extracurricular activities as well. Our first award this evening is going to be an Achievement in Acting Award. This award goes to a student whose role can range from a bit part to a secondary lead to a member of a chorus or an ensemble, or even a scene study performance in class. The recipient of this award, excuse me, um, not only created a well-crafted and nuanced performance, but also made effective use of the craft of acting to portray his or her character and to serve the overall production or scene. This year's recipients are Taylor Barbario for her performance of the Cake Monologues in the Theory of Relativity, Kenneth Pelfrey for his performance of Pi Parts 1, 2, and 3 in Theory of Relativity, and Vanessa Toyne for her performance of Julie's Song in Theory of Relativity. Our second award tonight is an International Baccalaureate Theater Award. This award is presented to a student or students in the International Baccalaureate Theater Program who have demonstrated academic excellence in the study of the theater arts. Our recipients this year are Lorelai King and Emma McCartan. Our final award tonight is the Kyle E. Smith Spirit Award. The Kyle E. S Smith Spirit Award is given to an underclass student who exemplifies the spirit of GHSTA in all the things that he or she does. This student may be involved in all aspects of theater productions, whether it be performance or technical, and demonstrates leadership, perseverance, self-advocacy, a positive attitude, and demonstrates community building and excellent communication skills. I am very proud this year to award this to Emma McCartan. Thank you very much, and we look forward to seeing you back on the stage next year at Guilford High School. Hello, my name is Megan Marciano, World Language Department Chair at Guilford High School, and it is my honor to represent all of the World Language teachers today in honoring the following students who have excelled in World Language study this year at Guilford High School. They have demonstrated a strong ability to speak, read, listen, and write in their target language and a deep respect for the cultures that these languages represent. For general excellence in Arabic, Cooper Woods, Christina Kalta, and Fareed Samu. For general excellence in Latin, Cole Philbin and Kira Hawks. For general excellence in French, Molly Peterson, Madeline Merkel Ward, Catherine Penna, Luke Robbins, and Ryan Ammer. For general excellence in Spanish, Savaya Knudsen, Ryan Bretman, Jason Lee, William Kong, Evan Stein, Clara Gom, Catherine Ellison, Luca Jarzakrak, Eliana Weinzimmer, Ariana Tomasi, Ruby Espejo, Stephen Hall, Rika Ashibi, Matthew Kotzbauer, Isabel Matthews, Madison Daggett, and Hannah Grafe. Congratulations to all, and the GHS World Language Department wishes you continued success in your world language studies. Good evening. We've now reached the portion where we'll be presenting our book awards to our junior recipients. First is the Brown University Book Award. 
and this is awarded to a junior who exhibits excellent verbal and written communication skills. This year's recipient is Lorelei King. The Dartmouth Book Award is awarded to a junior who ranks in the top 10% of the class and is of high moral character. This individual should have made a positive impact on the life of the GHS community and should have excelled in at least one non-academic area and have clear intellectual passion in a certain field. This year's recipient is Hannah Greif. The Gettysburg College Book Prize is awarded to a junior who has distinguished himself or herself in the study of American history. The ideal student for this honor is someone who demonstrates a dedication to scholarship and is among the top 10% of his or her class. This year's recipient is Luke Robbins. The Harvard Book Prize is awarded to a junior who combines excellence in academics with significant achievements in extracurricular activities. This year's recipient is Jerry Lee. When you're ready. Our next award is the Mount Holyoke Book Award, awarded to a female junior who has demonstrated exceptional achievement in academics, who has exhibited qualities of leadership or citizenship and service in the school community. She should also be enrolled in academically challenging college preparatory program that includes advanced placement or honors classes. This year's recipient is Emma McCartan. Next is the Oberlin College Book Award, awarded to an exceptional junior who has shown achievement in environmental awareness. This year's recipient is Nicholas Meeks. The Smith Book Award. This award is given to a junior girl who exemplifies qualities of academic achievement, leadership, and concern for others. The student must be in the top 10% of the class, possess these qualities, and serve as an example of scholarship and community service. And this year's recipient is Aaliyah Gibbons. The Springfield College Book Award. The candidate should demonstrate an exemplary record of service to their high school community and the community at large. And this year's recipient is Madison Daggett. The Sons of the American Revolution Award. This Good Citizenship Award is given to a junior boy or girl. It is awarded in recognition of outstanding character and patriotic leadership, thus putting into practice the high ideals and principles. And the student selected this year is Brennan Sinaway. Congratulations. Good evening. Thank you very much for joining us tonight. My name is Donna Pavlinski. I'm one of the assistant principals here at the high school. I am proud to announce several awards. First, the St. Michael's Book Award. This award is given to the top two juniors. They must be inductees of the National Honor Society or an equivalent organization sponsored by the school and have a sustained and sincere commitment to community service. This year's recipients are Matthew Kotzbauer and Anika Akamando. The next award is the Yukon Avery Point Book Award. This is for Coastal Environmental. It's awarded to students with demonstrated accomplishments or high potential for excellence in research, studies, and activities related to the marine sciences. This year's recipient is Sans Pasquisela. The Wellesley College Book Award is awarded to a junior girl whose academic record and character are exceptional and who has also made significant personal contribution to the school and the community. This year's recipient is Katrina Muse. The next award is the Wesleyan University Book Award. This is awarded to a male or female student in the junior class who demonstrates independent thought and creative thinking consistent with the spirit of free and energetic inquiry that's encouraged by Wesleyan University. The student has shown extracurricular achievement, school leadership, community involvement, and commitment to the arts. This year's recipient 
is Dominic Dadak. The next award is the Yale Book Award. This is awarded to a junior who has outstanding personal character and intellectual promise. This year's recipient is David Crair. And the last award this evening is one of my favorite to present. It is the Helen Berg Stresser Award. This is a award to a student who has shown the greatest academic improvement during the current school year after the third quarter. This year's recipient and congratulations to Ian Myers. Good job. Congratulations to all of the recipients for the Underclass Awards. We are so proud of all of you. We wanna thank you all for joining us for this presentation. We look forward to next year when we can hopefully do this in person. Please know for all underclassmen, you may pick up your awards and certificates and books in the main office starting tomorrow morning. Thank you. Have a good evening. Stay safe.